The Arrow Weapon System is a family of anti-ballistic missiles, jointly funded and produced by Israel and the United States. The system serves as a key component of Israel's defense architecture and is capable of intercepting short, medium, and intermediate-range ballistic missiles. First operationalized in 2000, the Arrow Weapon System has undergone several upgrades and improvements over the years and is currently considered one of the most advanced missile defense systems in the world. In this video, we'll be taking a closer look at the Arrow 3 Interceptor, the newest addition to the Arrow Weapon System. The Arrow 3 is an exo-atmospheric hypersonic anti-ballistic missile, and it is the latest addition to the Arrow Weapon System. As such, it is currently a key element of Israel's multi-layered defense missile array. The development of the Arrow 3 started in the late 2000s, when the need for an upper-tier component in Israel's ballistic missile defense system was identified. Arai Hartzog, the former director of the Israel Missile Defense Organization, stated that the main element of the upper-tier requirement would be an exo-atmospheric interceptor. But what exactly is an exo-atmospheric missile? An exo-atmospheric anti-ballistic missile is designed to intercept and destroy incoming ballistic missiles outside of the Earth's atmosphere or during the spaceflight portion of their trajectory, capable of destroying incoming threats carrying nuclear, chemical, biological, or conventional warheads. As an exo-atmospheric anti-ballistic missile system, the Aero 3's primary role is to serve as a last line of defense against incoming missiles, intercepting them at high altitude before they reach their target. It is designed to work in conjunction with other components of the Israeli Air Defense Command, such as the Aero 2 and Iron Dome, to provide a multi-layered defense against such attacks. In 2015, the Aero 3 successfully completed its first intercept in a test designed to assess its ability to detect, identify, track, and distinguish between real and decoy targets in space. This milestone paved the way toward low-rate initial production of the missile. In early 2017, the Aero 3 was declared fully operational. The Aero 3 missile features two solid propulsion stages, including a booster and a sustainer, providing an operational range of around 2,400 km and the capability to intercept threats at an altitude of 100 km. The missile has a lightweight carbon fiber structure and thrust vector control, allowing it to maneuver quickly and effectively in the exo-atmosphere reaching greater speeds compared to the Aero 2 system, which had a maximum speed of Mach 9.0. The missile system employs hit-to-kill technology, but in contrast to most kill vehicles that rely on liquid or gas propulsion, the Aero 3 is powered by a conventional rocket motor. The missile is launched vertically, and then its trajectory is adjusted towards the predicted point of interception. This allows it to be launched into an area of space before it is known where the enemy missile is going. The kill vehicle is launched once the hostile warhead is identified and the target is close enough. The Aero 3 system can be launched from a silo but is also highly mobile, making it easy to deploy and operate in a variety of locations. The Erector Launcher trailer can be towed by a military truck. The launcher provides the system with vertical hot launch capability from sealed canisters. Each launcher has the capacity to hold six canisters. Interestingly enough, the launcher, along with other system components, can accommodate both the Aero 3 and Aero 2 systems. The Aero 3 system employs ELTA's Super Green Pine radar for early warning and fire control, which operates in the L-band frequency. The radar provides long-range target detection, as well as the ability to track multiple targets at once. This capability enables the Aero 3 battery to intercept salvos of more than five ballistic missiles within 30 seconds. Additionally, the system is capable to counter sensor outages and jamming attempts through electronic counter countermeasures. It also includes a higher resolution electro optical sensor, which acquires the target for the kill vehicle to intercept and destroy the warhead. The Aero 3 has been deployed by the Israeli military and is currently operational. Apart from its obvious military applications, the Aero 3 system may serve as an anti-satellite weapon. This would make Israel one of a select few nations with the capability to shoot down satellites. The Aero 3 missile system is being considered for sale to other countries that want to improve their missile defense capabilities. 
Some reports suggest that Azerbaijan evaluated the possibility of acquiring the Aero 3 system during the 2021 tensions with Iran. Similarly Germany also looked into buying the system as a defense against potential Russian missiles, but the sale was blocked by the US. Although the Aero 3 missile system is a highly capable defense system due to its range, speed, advanced guidance system, and maneuverability, it is important to note that in April 2021, Israel acknowledged that it was unable to shoot down Syrian missiles that entered Israeli airspace on multiple occasions. What do you think about the Aero 3? Let us know in the comments below. If you're interested in defense and want to keep up with the latest developments, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more content.